This is the DRV8711 booster pack from Texas Instruments. To begin, I'm using a 12 volt wall wart connected to uh, the VM and ground of the board, as shown. Now when I connect it, what you'll see is that when I read the status register, which is the uh, bottom row on that screen, you'll notice that uh, all the bits are clear, meaning that uh, everything should be running normally. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use is this 24 volt uh, power supply to power it. So here I've got it hooked up the same way and uh, just having the uh, positive to VM and uh, ground to the common of the power supply. Now the first thing you'll notice when I turn power on is that the red fault line or excuse me, the red fault LED is lit on the uh, board. Also if you uh, look at the um, output as soon as I refresh it you'll notice now that there's a 1 in the uh, UVLO bit uh, showing that there's an under voltage fault. Now that should be with a 24 volt power supply that shouldn't be happening. Now I can try to clear that by writing a uh, zero to that bit, um, but when I refresh it what you'll see is that I still have that one and I don't show it on uh, this image but on the board the uh, red LED is still lit. Now I can go ahead and reset my Arduino which should write all the registers again and uh, kind of refresh them, um, which would include uh, writing a zero to that bit, um, but when I refresh it again, or when I read the, the registers again, you'll see that the number, uh, the one is still in the UVLO bit. Uh, you can also see that the uh, torque number refreshed back to my defaults, uh, showing that the registers are being written and read properly. Now, just, uh, just so you understand this kind of bundle of wires, I know it's a little bit of a rat's nest here. These four wires that I'm holding are for the uh, go to the motor. I've got uh, four uh, wires going from the Arduino uh, right there that are the SPI for communication. And then I have a direction and step, uh, a wire there to handle the direction and step uh, signals. Um, finally, I've got uh, the, the 5 volt, plus 5 volt, and ground line uh, which uh, I guess are necessary for communications and for the LED. This just shows the uh, section of my script where I attempt to uh, clear that UVLO bit. I have a few other commands in there uh, that all seem to work fine. They write and read the registers uh, perfectly. Finally, just for verification, I just wanted to check and make sure that I was getting uh, 24 volts um, at that point, and uh, sure enough, I am. So there's my issue. I hope you guys can help me out.